Hey, what's going on guys? How's everyone doing today? I'm doing pretty well. Thank you for asking. Well, this is another episode of The Body Beatdown. I'm Michael, your little bitty, teeny tiny, itty bitty weakling of a host. That's how I feel on this day especially, deadlift day. I am the biggest, weakest guy you'll ever meet. It just happens, guys. You know, over time you lose, you lose some of your strength. And I've lost weight, and of course, my goals are not what they used to be, so I'm not impressive to watch in the gym, but I'm the kind of guy you need to watch anyway because I'm real and more people can connect with uh, weaker people. <laughs> so I'm gonna, I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna use that as a plus. I'm weaker, but you can connect with me better because I'm weaker. So to, like I said, today is deadlift day. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to go and try to max out and try and get a PR today. I don't feel real strong today. I just had my pre-workout and it was good. But I'm not feeling real strong today. <clears throat> I don't know if I'm going to try and go heavy and get a PR or if I'm just going to go lightweight and get like, you know, 8 to 10 reps or something like that uh, with a few sets. Um, not real certain. What I am going to do first, though, is warm up on my Smith machine without any weights. Just get a little bit of movement going in my back and uh, uh, just get a little movement. Let's get some movement, guys. Come on. One eighty five. Two zero five. Two twenty five. Mm. 
So guys, I'm up to 315. As we all know, I'm getting close to my threshold. Uh, I just put the 45s on and uh, just taking a slight little extra breather here to uh, just kind of compose myself and get myself a little rested. As you can tell, my reps went down pretty quick and that's because I try to conserve some energy. <clears throat> I feel like I do enough along the way to warm myself up. I mean, we don't need tons of warm up. Uh, we'll get worn out. So I'm uh, about to get this and my thumb is wrapped because last Saturday I kept rubbing my thumb raw on my pants when I'm doing these. I kept rubbing my thumb on my pants and the same thing with my shin. You know how that happens when you're deadlifting? Well, that's what I was doing with my thumb. So I got it wrapped up. I don't wanna pop it back open again. So let me get ready to do this, guys. 315. Did you just see that 365 go up like that? Now, I can't remember if that's my, if that's a new personal record or not, or if I have to go to like 370, I don't remember. <laughs> wow, I'm very happy. I'll be happier if I put a five on each side and get 375. Let's try it, guys. You, you don't know until you try. All right. Three seventy five. Three seventy five, guys. That I do believe is a PR. Wow. If you go back and watch the video from last Saturday, 
I don't even budge. If it was last Saturday or Saturday before, I think it was last Saturday. I don't remember. Go watch all my videos. All right, let me stop this video and set the camera back up. We're about to discuss something. All right, man, I'm super happy. Ooh, I felt a strain on my back too, though. I can feel it. <laughs> I might have rounded my back just a tad. Not so much in the middle of my back, but more towards the tailbone. That's where my problem is, is right at my tailbone and way down there at that lower part. Whew. I mean, it's not hurt. I didn't throw it out or anything. I don't even think it's going to be inflamed or anything messed up more than it, you know, is every day. Uh, if it, I feel fine right now. Wow. 375, guys. Give me a second. Deadlifts, 219.22. Okay, I didn't, I didn't try to go heavy last weekend. Uh, last weekend I was doing, uh, trying to keep my reps a little bit higher, but uh, my stupid thumb was driving me, it was getting rubbed raw, so it screwed up that workout a little bit. Uh, should be here. Deads. I got 365 last week for one rep. I think I tried, was decently. So 365, Ooh, I'm glad I went up. Those two little plates, that 10 pounds, five pounds on each side. Uh, 365 uh, was what I did. Back on 212.22. Yes. So, whew, I'm going to say it's probably a new personal record. New PB. Personal best, even. Uh, that's what I'm going to call it. Now, did I do more at one point in my time when I was younger? I don't know. I've often told people that I've deadlifted in the fours. I think one time I might have, but... I don't, I don't have any proof of it. I don't think I wrote that down back years ago. I don't think I, I don't know. I don't think I did. So I'm just going to say, I'm going to say 375 is my PR for my lifetime because I have a record of it right here <laughs> and on paper. So man, I'm totally hyped and happy about that. Now, typically on my deadlift day, I would continue going and do a few more sets. I'm stopping right there. I'm going to call it done on the deads and on my deadlift day I also like to incorporate usually one more movement and that one movement is biceps and typically I'll do you know five six sets of just some easy uh, bicep curls so I'm going to do that I might do it later and let myself kind of cool down a little bit and relax and uh, yeah so anyway guys I'm super happy let me put this up Um, and again, I am so lucky to be able to even walk at the age of 50 because I didn't think I'd even make it this long. So to be able to hit, in my opinion, a, a PR at 50 on a deadlift, which has always been an extremely difficult lift for me, a dangerous lift for me, man, I'm, I'm stoked. I'm so happy. Uh, yeah. So anyway, guys, if you, if you watch this video and you shared this with me, this moment, I thank you and I appreciate it. You can do the same thing every day if you push and you're uh, you're vigilant and you keep at whatever it is that you're trying to accomplish. Uh, yeah. Anyway, <laughs> so I'm gonna I'm gonna be done in here for right now, and I might, like I said, I might come in here and do a little bit of arms later, just for heck of it. <sighs> I'm happy. Guys, thanks for watching the Body Beat Down. I'm Michael, your eh, incredible host. Now I'm going to go in there and enjoy my cheat day, which is really just some uh, ground turkey burritos. <laughs> Nothing super crazy, but I'm going to have french fries. So anyway, guys, 
inspire someone today along the way, and most importantly, inspire yourself because you matter most in life. No matter what you think, you matter most. If you can't take care of yourself, you can't take care of nobody else. All right? Get up, get out, get red, do it to it. Also, go support my buddy, John Mac Bean Scottish Fitness. His name is John. His channel name is Mac Bean Scottish Fitness. All right? Go check him out. He's a cool guy. He's a little bit older than me, and he shows you that you can still keep kicking butt uh, long after 50, okay? And I hope him the best and that he keeps kicking till he's 110. So, all right. Love everybody. Have a good day. Good night. See you later. Get up, get out, get ready.